Yeah? Just for you. What about Patrick and Yolande? Oh, they're out for the day. They got all loved up after Din's party. All right, then. Where are you? Back to work. Yeah, I'll catch you up. Nah! We can't find you, you know. He's spoken for. I'm not. I don't think Mickey would want you. With or without cream cakes around your face. We'll see about that. You seen Lucy? Why, are you wishing your little mate? No, I just need something to take my mind off the job. <sighs> Try standing out there all day with having punters gulp at you. I could hide in here. I ain't hanging around with you. Why not? Cos you're a loser. No, I ain't. Prove it. No. Maybe we should tell someone, like the social. You being here is only gonna make things worse. Come on. Oh. Come on. What's the matter with you? What? Take it, Mum Rose. Getting cleaned up, will you? You took it, didn't you? Took what? I don't even know what you're on about. Don't lie to a son. You're only going to make it worse for yourself in the long run. I ain't done nothing. I ain't asking you again, Darren. Right, it was a few weeks ago. Hey? Well, he takes for a couple of mugs or something. Because she's only just got it. What? Dawn's perfume. I know it reeks and all that, but it was her Christmas present from Michael. You don't go and nick it. Well, I didn't. You just said you did. Well, I was confused. I ain't seen it since you sent me out in the morning. If you're lying to us, I'll string you up. No, honestly, I'm not. I ain't touched it. Yeah? What's in the bag? You will get out of my salon and you will stay out. You try flogging your rookie gear around here again, I'll give you what for. Go on. Right. Nice doing business with you. A problem with a bit of free enterprise. Don't make an enemy of me, Darren, because I will have you. Now clear off. Oi! No! What are you got in there? None of your business. Are the drugs in there? No. Well, what are you trying to hide? I'll drop dead. That's it. You're being ridiculous, both of you. Very handy. I need new give phone. it back to him, Sean. Mick, just leave it. Just leave it, Mick. Yeah, Mick, just leave it. Sean, give him back his phone. <sighs> All right, Mickey, come and get it. Huh? That rush thing you said. You must think I'm some idiot. Of course not. What, you two planned this together, did you? No, I had nothing to do with it. I trusted you. Hey! You've done everything. I'm going to kill you, you little mug. You're coming in. You think you're hard enough? Oh, you are dead. Yeah? Hey, come and get in the pair of you. No, he started it. I am sick and tired of all this, all right? We have all got to live under the same roof, so you two have got to find a way of getting on. Well, no, not me, Dawn. I ain't going to spend another minute in the same house. What I'm getting at, I just... You know that bloke, you know, he gave you those dodgy cars on the cheap? I thought maybe I could shift a few. Just till I found my feet, got things ticking over. Do you seriously think I'm going to risk that again, eh? Well, you gave them to Kevin. Yeah. Yeah, and look how he ended up. Well, that was because Kevin was an idiot and I ain't, so give me the chance to prove myself. You know, when you blagged that 200 quid off me for keeping your mouth shut, I thought you was a pretty cool kid, but you got even colder now, aren't you? Yeah, it's because I'm desperate. Just one car pays for it's all I'm asking. Forget it. From now on, that place is legit. No more stolen cars, no more cut and shuts. What do you want to do, get somebody else killed? Oh, all right, just give me the bloke's number, I'll call him myself. Listen, as soon as you called him, he put the phone down. Now, it's too dangerous, the old bill nearly got us last time. Oh, come on, Phil, one car. Listen, if you ask me one more time, all right, I'll get packed to kick you out of that job, and not only that, I'll kick you out of that suit. Now, go on, sling your hook. Go on, out, out! The bloke's property. You what? <laughs> Next time... <laughs> I'll cut him off. <laughs> Any money's covered in acne. <laughs> it's only a bit of a laugh. I don't take it seriously. Oh, I love this bit. Dear Jenny, I think I'm in love with my older sister's boyfriend. We haven't done anything yet, but every time he comes round, I find myself looking at him and he looks back at me. What should I do? Stop it. What? You're making fun of me. I'm not making fun of you. I'm just making fun of the magazine. Why? I forgave you. I was willing to put all that bad stuff behind us. What Come on, just a quick one. Mona. I just want to go home. And what are you going to be doing at home? Let's go now. Why are you being such a killjoy? Don't start, Darren. No, come on, you've only said two words to me all day. Yeah, that's because if I talk to you, I might actually have to oh, look at you. Baby, just calm down. But I've been trying to be calm. Oh, stop being stupid. I'm going to the club. Yeah, yeah, and then maybe you'll meet somebody and get them pregnant too. Just like you did with Heather.
I know, Darren. I know you're George's father. 